How were the Egyptian pyramids built? Was it all slaves and simple tools? Or was there something more mysterious at play? Today, we're going to dive deep into the world of ancient Egypt and explore how the Great Pyramids of Giza were constructed using mind-blowing techniques, from magnetic forces to help from other civilizations, and the power of the Nile River. Stick around, because what we're about to uncover may just change the way you see the ancient world. Standing tall for over 4,500 years, the pyramids of Egypt have long been a source of fascination and mystery. The Great Pyramid of Giza, the last remaining wonder of the ancient world, is made up of over 2.3 million limestone blocks, each weighing between 2 and 15 tons. But here's the question, how did the ancient Egyptians manage to build such massive structures without modern tools? Could they have had secret techniques that we're just now beginning to understand? To start answering that question, let's talk about the Nile River. The ancient Egyptians didn't just use the Nile for water, it was their ultimate transportation highway. During the annual flooding of the Nile, large amounts of limestone and other materials were easily transported from quarries far away, like the Tura quarries that supplied the smooth, white limestone for the outer casing of the Great Pyramid. But that's not all. The river may have been used in ways that we are still discovering today. Could they have used the river's current to float massive blocks? Some experts believe that boats fitted with sophisticated systems may have been used, but was there something else, something even more advanced at play? Could magnetic forces have been used to lift and move these massive stones? Let's dive into one of the more controversial theories. The idea that the Egyptians used magnetic forces or even anti-gravity technology to assist with construction. Sounds like science fiction, right? But hear me out. Ancient texts and modern research are pointing towards something extraordinary. Magnetic materials were likely part of the stones used in the construction of the pyramids. Some researchers, like the famous author and historian David Childress, believe the ancient Egyptians may have discovered ways to harness the Earth's natural magnetic fields. If they did, it would explain how they could move and lift massive stones without the need for ramps or other obvious lifting mechanisms. Could ancient Egypt have been much more advanced than we realize? Could they have had access to forgotten technologies that modern science is just starting to rediscover? The use of magnets to levitate blocks or even alter their weight could have made the impossible possible. Now, let's take things even further. What if the Egyptians didn't build the pyramids entirely on their own? What if they had help from other advanced civilizations? It's a theory that has gained traction in recent years, especially in the works of scholars like Graham Hancock. Some suggest that ancient civilizations, like those in South America, may have had similar pyramid-building knowledge. In fact, many ancient cultures across the world share similar architectural styles and construction techniques. Could there have been an ancient global network of builders exchanging knowledge long before written history? Imagine that the ancient Egyptians didn't just rely on local resources, but were part of a much broader network of knowledge where ideas and techniques were exchanged, shaping the way they build the pyramids. All right, so let's break down some of the most popular and plausible construction techniques. We know the Egyptians used ramps to transport blocks, but how did they do it without modern cranes or machinery? Here are a few ideas. First, the straight ramp theory suggests a massive ramp system was built to move blocks up the pyramid sides. However, more recent theories propose the use of a spiral ramp, possibly wrapping around the pyramid as it was built, or even internal ramps that were hidden within the pyramid structure. Some believe that the ancient Egyptians used counterweights and pulleys to assist in lifting massive stones. But the most fascinating part of the pyramid construction isn't just how they were built, it's why. The ancient Egyptians believed that the pyramids were not only tombs, but powerful cosmic machines. Could these structures have been designed to harness and amplify Earth's natural energies? Some believe the pyramids were aligned with the stars, particularly the constellation of Orion, which was associated with Osiris, the god of the afterlife. Was the pyramid's construction tied to some form of celestial energy or an ancient understanding of energy fields that we have yet to fully grasp? So, 
How were the pyramids built? Was it magnets, ramps, or help from ancient civilizations? The truth is, we may never know all the answers, but that's what makes the mystery of the pyramid so captivating. It's a symbol of ancient ingenuity, lost knowledge, and the never-ending quest to understand the mysteries of the past. Want more mind-blowing mysteries like this? Hit that like button, subscribe, and ring the bell so you don't miss out on the next deep dive into history's most fascinating secrets. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.